Hi there everyone, welcome to Ideation HQ, the number one channel for the latest news in regards to digital learning technologies. In today's episode, we will be looking at Shobi and how you can create a new class in Shobi. And I'll be showing you two ways in which you can do this. The first method that I'll be sharing is to create a new Shobi class from scratch. For us to do that, let's access the toolbar icon here and then click on new class. Here you will enter the details for your class. This class is for the new academic year, which is 2022. And then the class, let's call it 7A. Let's enter the subject, English, and then the teacher's initial. You can name your class any way you want. Here you have the option of whether you want to enable student-led portfolios and whether you also want to enable parent access. I am going to enable the student-led portfolios and uncheck parent access. Once I'm happy with the options, I'll click on save. And here is the new Shobi class that I just created. Let's click on that. And you will see that it's pretty much an empty shell. No assignments have been created and also folders have not been assigned. So as a teacher, this is where I start to populate my resources before releasing them to my students. The second method is to create a new class from an existing Shobi class. And there are many benefits of doing this. It saves me a lot of time from recreating and reorganizing my Shobi class, as all the resources will then be copied over to the new Shobi class. And you do this because the assignments that you're giving out to your students are pretty much the same, or you want to make small little modifications to the assignments that you're going to share with your students. So let's have a look at this class here. It's a 2021 year 11 class. The subject is visual communication and design. And this is the teacher initial for that class. I am now going to copy this whole Shobi class for the next academic year. So let's access this toolbar and then click on settings. And here you will see that there is this option to copy class. Let's click on that. So for this case here, I'm going to keep things simple. I'm going to update the academic year to 2022. And I'm going to update my teacher initial to SAM. Um, I'm going to check this option here. And then once you're happy with all the settings, click on copy class. And here you will see that the folders have been copied over. And if I were to click on any one of the folder, the assignments have been copied over and they are now in locked mode. Let's click on one of the assignment and access the tool icon here. So as a teacher, all I need to do now is to review my assignment and assign a new due date, um, which is going to be based on the new academic year, and then set it to editable, which will then allow the students to work on their assignments. So today I've shared with you two quick and simple ways where you can create a new class in Shobi. If you find today's video useful, please remember to click on the like button. And if you want to receive more news and updates in regards to digital learning technologies from Ideation HQ, remember to click on the subscribe button. So that's all for today. I'll see you again next time. Bye.